Vayalin Sham, and he lay down there. Be Megillah Daf Gimel Sof Amad Aleph Aminan. So it says in Gemara Megillah, Vayalin Yehoshua, that before crossing the Yarden, Yehoshua laid down. Shalon Ba Umgra Shel Halacha. That so our sages said that he laid down in the depth of halacha. That it wasn't just he went to sleep, but that before he, he crossed the Yardain, he went deep into halacha. So it says that my beloved is to me and lays down between my breasts. And so it's a concept of laying down uh, Yalin in love. What is this referring to? Shabadi Ha'aron Hayun Nirim Kimo Shnei Dade Isha, that the two staves of the Aaron would stick out in the of the from the curtain in the base of Mikdash, the first base of Mikdash, like two breasts of a woman. So between the two breasts is the concept of the Luchos, the concept of Torah, <coughs> with the love of Hashem. Like the idea is that it's just like blood is congealed and becomes and becomes milk. So too is the idea of the Arna Kodesh that you should make your Torah you should make your Torah set, I guess like congealing like milk. Similar to the concept of by the Aaron, that the staves were not uh, allowed to be moved, removed from it, just like a Torah that's set. And that that is to overcome your yetzer by subjugating it and pushing it from this. The it's like the blood that comes becomes milk. The kviya from Lashem Kafoi is, I guess, uh, the same language. It's the same. It sounds the same as kviya from Lashem is kafia and and um, pushing and subjugating. That is the revelation of the inner concept of Torah. Like it's like it says in another place on the verse that my breasts are like uh, towers. That this refers to the concept of the secrets of the Torah, the the chalav, like the vashim chalav. And that's why the land of Israel, which is the oral Torah. Is called the land that flows with milk and honey. Um, uh, like Tachas Lishonecha. Like the milk and honey that's under the tongue, the secrets. That's in a part of the Torah Shabal I guess. Valkain bin Shaddai Yalin, and therefore he lies between my breasts. But Inyan the Yalin Dafka, and the concept of to lie down specifically. Why to lie down? Because at night you sing with me. That the concept of song is like the idea of the reasons of Torah or the timing in the Torah Shabbat So that's the song. The song is the, the timing and the reasons. Look what it says there about the concept of of Shira and Shiro that it one is it's read uh, Shiro but it's written Shira that it's a Yichud of the Chasen and Kala. Look what it says there about the candle of Hanukkah from the left side to shine the darkness. Like 
Lukas brought about the concept of that you are my candle with the concept of that Hashem will shine my darkness. With the concept of that the day is with is with the night, that first it's dark and then it's day. So all of this is a concept of shining the darkness. That's why it says, "In night you will sing with me," that you that you lie down at night with the with the oral Torah with the secrets because you're shining into the darkness. That's why you learn Torah at night. And through flipping darkness into light by through the study of Torah, so you draw down from the supernal darkness of Hashem that He places darkness as His hiding place. The higher kind of darkness. Also, we can awaken to the idea that it's the dew descends at night specifically. That the dew is a concept that's very high, beyond that which we can reach with our arousal from below. That's what shines at night specifically. So you get this extra revelation. And the dew will rest, will lie down in in my uh, my cuttings of my grain. So the, again, the concept of Yalin, to lie down, and the Tal is included. That is exactly the opposite. She's ordered to be serious to awaken, to wake up from from with the from the sleeping of the nighttime, to be aroused with an arousal from below. Um, that the, I guess that's am shara to arouse to arouse that. And similarly is the concept of to sing in the nighttime with me. I guess like uh, getting up for tikkun chatzos. And look what's brought on the verse. I am sleeping, but my heart is awake because my head is full of dew. So again, you have uh, an equation of of sleeping together with the concept of dew. Revelation into the darkness of nighttime.